Aloha, everybody. Aloha. You know, this is a this is a sad day, maybe a good day, could be a good day. We have the opportunity, maybe as a community, to maybe turn this thing around. Well, listen, I think you made the case clear. Very good. So there, there's no need to come up and add more issues. And funny, I look at this setting here, it's like a civics class. We're going to get everybody together and teach our kids how we conduct ourselves to resolve a problem and find a solution that they can live with, we can live with. That we can go forward with. So we can get emotional, we can get angry, and we deserve to be. But in the end, we want to find a solution because our kids demand that. We want them to continue to learn, learn better, learn at a higher level. What is very clear here is that the process of collaboration went wrong. And it went wrong by the board and not the students or the teachers or the time. So we're hearing the apologies, but we're not hearing the, co the corrections. I've been on the floor a lot today with Honolulu, and Honolulu's not happy with what's happened here. Oh. 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 We all feel a sense of shame that our princess, Hawaiian Bishop, who intended that the monies that would be used in such a collaboration would be a process of people actually getting together and talking to one another. Instead of being in boardrooms, making decisions behind closed doors. That is not why men. That's why many of us have moved here and raised our children here. We don't want to hide don't live in this town and speak with words like gang orders and I can't tell you why I hurt you so bad. I can't tell you why. See what's happened here that stands up and I'm so proud of our children and our parents and this town that the town didn't just go away, be belittled, have a board come, plead, beg, them. In fact, the seating should have been just the opposite. You guys should have been up here, and they should have been up here. Because these islands, the outer islands, have a message. I think there's some clarity tonight. The people will not stand by while a man from their tongue who served the town so well for so many years and watch him in one quick stroke of a board meeting somewhere on a wall have his name, his reputation and everything that he's done and what his family stands for get moved in and nobody knows why no one will say why but we have a polite apology that we can't say anything that's not acceptable. That's not acceptable. <laughs> you represent a Hawaiian entity. Kuka Kuka. We're to talk. We're not to make excuses. We're supposed to stand and find solutions. The rumors out of Honolulu are crazy that somebody on this board got a little ego now. Because Mr. Colson went and applied for a job someplace, and someone then says, Well, then you're disloyal to our little board. You're out of here. I hope that's not true. I hope it's not true. But the truth will bleed out. The truth is going to come out. It's the year I called you myself. Your secretary told me you would call back. 
I had many other people, including trustees from Kamehameha schools, try to reach you. And, and it wasn't to belittle you or anyone. This is a small problem. This is an astronomical problem that we cannot solve. But if one of us, any of us, have pride, whole country, and dig in with that, we will resolve nothing. But the problem is we're teaching our children that. If a board can come here and say these, behind these kind of words that it's legal, it's not right, we're gagged, and they cannot hear the truth, you're teaching them to go hide the truth. that a man who didn't deserve it was so wounded by an outside entity with one stroke of a vote. That now, that, is, that onus is on you now. It's not for us to come up here one at a time and ask you and beg you if you would reverse that. You must. Yes. You must. Yeah. Study the history of this land into ancient times. It has this kind of a cornerstone reputation of making decisions and turning things for the better. You can be part of it. We want you. I want you to be part of it. I want you to rise above the boardroom and those nice chairs and tables there. Rise above them. Yee Make a decision. Schedules for the mist to come and some other person to come. Don't belittle this group. Don't belittle this group. What would be best for you to see is we need to go back and think this over again. Instead of just sitting here and saying to this group, it is done, it is said, it is over. It's not. Mr. Colson is not dead, he is alive.
that this wrong that has been done by this group can be rectified. So that the name Koro Kako can go throughout the islands and do good instead of itself also being tainted by your decision in this town. It won't go away. It won't go away. We can't come tonight and you'll send somebody and we'll forget about it. We'll never forget. We'll never forget. Never. Come. Amen. 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 <laughs> 